Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for being here. I am Meredith, I am a mid-size and curvy content creator and I have a very exciting haul and try on for you today from dun dun dun, Aerie. This is really my only second time ever shopping at Aerie. And the first haul and try on I did probably about maybe a year and a half ago, two years ago, was one of my favorite haul and try ons because I just found so many good things. I'm hoping today will be just like that because I have some amazing and incredible pieces that I want to show you guys. If you guys are new here, I am a size 8, sometimes a size 10, and sometimes also a size 6. I'm a medium on top and medium on bottom, generally across the board. I am 5'7", I have a 36 inch bust that goes all the way around. I'm a 34 D cup, I am a 29 inch waist, and I'm a 44 inch hip. And what I do is I create lots of hauls and try-ons from different stores and different brands so that way you guys can see what the clothing looks like on a curvy body because oftentimes the model doesn't look like us. So I hope these hauls and try-ons will help you ladies make life and shopping for our bodies and our curves that much easier. So like I said, today I have a Aerie haul and try on and I can't wait to show you guys what I got. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. Let's just take a moment and admire this cut of pant on this curvy body of mine. It's just, I mean, it just could not be more perfect. Woo, these are good. These are good, baby. What I also love about these leggings is that they are buttery soft. Like, I wish you guys could just reach through the camera and feel this material. It is lightweight. It's really stretchy. I feel like pretty secure and pretty held up and pretty held in. Maybe a tiny bit lifted, not to the extreme, but enough to make me feel comfortable. And then I really love the sort of like extreme flare that's happening on the bottom. I love that everything is not just skinny cut anymore. I do love my skinny jeans and I'm always going to wear those no matter what the trends are or what's, you know, hot right now. But I definitely love you know, switching it up and changing it up a little bit. Okay, moving on to the top. I love this sort of little bralette. There is a built-in shelf bra underneath. The coverage is great, but this is definitely not like a sports bra type thing. I definitely wouldn't wear this to work out in just because it doesn't give me a lot of compression for any sort of high intensity or even medium intensity. I mean, you might be able to get away with doing yoga in this, but I would wear this as like a casual outfit and not actually work out in it. But anyways, I think that this two-piece set is a 10 out of 10 for me, and let's move on to the next one. Okay, next up is this super, 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 super cute dress. Now, let me just explain a little bit about this. The first time I saw a dress like this was on Abercrombie's website. I went to go order it. It was out of my size. So here I am in a very similar dress from Aerie in my size. I'm in a size medium. On Abercrombie's website, it's called the Traveler's Dress. This dress is essentially made out of like what you would buy in a workout outfit, right? Like you could probably play tennis in this, but you could also wear it as like an athleisure, really super cute outfit. Let's talk about the fit. So the fit is giving me a little bit of trouble. Is this part back here because my butt is so wide, it sticks out, it protrudes. So it's pulling the fabric away from my body when it really should just be hugging it. So there is like this little bit of room that is bothering me here. The skirt is really short, guys. Like, I'm talking about like really short. My butt ends right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys. It does have shorts underneath. Don't, don't worry, I'm not gonna flash you. But the shorts are really short. I really only like things that are four inches long because that way they don't ride up on me and they also protect my legs from chafing. These are a little on the short side, okay? They do have pockets on either side, which I think is great. But let me just show you guys in the back how incredibly short they are. Okay, my butt is hanging out the bottom of the shorts. What the heck? And on top of it, because it's almost like a onesie, this part is attached to obviously the shorts. So it's not really hugging my body where it should. You guys can see a little bit closer, right? There's a lot of this extra fabric. It should be sitting very close to my body, but because my butt is pushing out the fabric, like always, it's giving me a little bit of a problem. The skirt obviously isn't that much longer than the shorts underneath. So that just means if I want to just 
take a risk and wear something really short that the wind may catch it and you may get a booty shot. I have to be in a very particular mood to wear something like that. <laughs> Everything is super stretchy. The straps on the back are adjustable. So if you do need a little bit more lift or to let it out a little bit more, it's great because you can just adjust it to your body and your shape. I'm obsessed with this. Let me know if you guys think that I should keep this or if I should return it. I'm kind of on the fence because it's so daggone short. Because I kind of have like a tennis skirt or dress on, I feel like I need to tell you guys about this tennis necklace that I have on. This is from Melinda Maria. It is a stunning, stunning, stunning necklace. And I just felt like it was perfect to wear for every day, but not have it be super in your face. This is just a little side note. I will leave the link below. I think it's amazing. Tennis necklace and tennis dress. I wanted to point out one more detail. This is actually like almost like a wrap skirt like that. So it comes down in front and then it has this wrap part on the top. And then it has sort of this like angled hemline that goes into the bottom. That is like a really terrible way of explaining it, but I really, really, really love that look. This is almost identical to Abercrombie's, and then you can see a little bit more closely that it has this sort of like angled hemline that kind of comes down into the skirt, which I absolutely love. What is life right now? What is life? Like our, what? This? Are you kidding me? Uh, okay. This may be the first time ever that I bought something black to show you guys. I never buy black clothing because it just doesn't look good with my skin and it doesn't go with my personality. I feel like I am bright and bubbly and colorful and you know what I'm saying? Like I just need color in my life. But this two piece black set, what? <laughs> what? We are in a two piece sweatpant material set in black. And this top is essentially like a cutoff sweatshirt. So just imagine like a sweatshirt, you cut the sleeves off, this is the vibe of this sweatshirt. So let's just talk about the sizing really fast. I'm in a medium top and bottom. Right here, it's giving me a little bit of a hard time, but it's meant to be an oversized and baggy look. So in reality, it doesn't bother me whatsoever because I just want this sort of like cutoff vibe. If it was actually fitted like that, it wouldn't give me the same feeling, I guess. Medium, I think is fine. It does have a hood, which is super cute as well. And drawstring at the neckline. It is super cropped. Actually, it's not super cropped. It's just cropped because I pulled it up a little bit. I could technically wear it down here, but I wanted to see a little bit of my midriff. So I just pulled it up just a bit on my stomach area. It's super stretchy, has a really stretchy elastic and it's not super tight, which means comfort, right? Like this is super comfortable. I even love my faux diamond tennis necklace sort of popping out the top, just peeking ever so slightly from the sweatshirt. I think that it just elevates the look so much. And I just think that it's a great addition. Moving on to this lovely skirt. It is essentially like a pencil style skirt. The material is stretchy. It has a tie at the waistband and also an elastic waistband. So you don't actually really need to tie this super tight if you don't want to. You can if you want, if you need it, but I just sort of let the elastic sort of do its job and then I just tie this for style essentially. It's pretty much useless. I think that it's just a great little style addition because it sort of just pulls in the sweatshirt and the sweatpant look. I think that this fits me so well. I actually really like it in black. I believe they do have it in other colors. I think that the bottoms fit me so well. It just accentuates the booty, which is always great. I love the length that's hitting me right in the middle of my calf, which I don't find this sort of length very often. Again, just for reference, I'm 5'7". If you are a little bit taller, it will probably be a little bit shorter on you. And if you are a little bit shorter than me, it's probably gonna be a lot longer on you. But I would definitely style this with like a pair of sneakers or maybe even just like a sandal. I think that this is super cute. It is a keeper. I have no idea why I ordered this skirt. I think I had not high hopes, but just hopes of perhaps it working out to my favor, to my body's favor, but it did not. And that's okay. 
it's completely fine I think I had initially seen this and I wanted to maybe wear it as like a golf skirt or something of that nature but this just does not work for me and I'll tell you why Whoosh. this is why this is why this is why if I wasn't as curvy and I was more of a rectangle shape and I didn't have big thighs or a big booty this would be perfect super cute and not on Le Body. And second of all, I mean, this color is a color that you guys know that I stay away from because it essentially looks like my skin tone. And that is never a good thing. You don't want to have clothing that blends in with your skin, right? Like you want to have contrasting colors against your skin. So I usually stay away from this color. The bottoms are the same color. Like it looks like I have nude shorts on. Let's talk about the things that I do like about it. I really love the fact that it's longer in the front, shorter on the sides, and then longer again in the back. I think that style is really flattering. But again, it's just way too short for me. The shorts underneath are too short for me as well. This is kind of like the dress in a sense but for some reason this just feels way shorter i think partially because you can see the legging um underneath the skirt but i really like the leopard print i do like that it's high-waisted it's super stretchy fabric it fits pretty well i mean through my waist and my butt i always try to make like mini skirts work for me but i just need to like ingrain it in brands brains that not everybody has the same shaped body. And we, as curvy women, would like to have mini skirts for us too. Thanks. Let's move on to maybe the most epic t-shirt I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> Woo, yes! I cannot wait to take an epic photo in this shirt when I go to Cabo in a couple of weeks because I mean, enjoy the view. As you guys know, I love my body, I love my curves, I love my booty, I love my butt, I love my buttocks, I love the peach, all of this. There's going to be an epic photo. This t-shirt is a size small. It is very soft and cozy feeling. It's really, really like super uber comfortable. I did get a small, it does actually run, it's supposed to be like an oversized look, but I really knew that I was gonna wear it, tying it either in the back or the front. Let me just go ahead and show you that this is a small, right? So imagine if I had gotten a medium or a large, it would be, you know, longer and much more oversized. So just keep that in mind when ordering because, um, Again, this is a small and it runs big, it runs generous because it's supposed to be an oversized look, but I know that I was going to style it a specific way and we didn't want to cover the view. If I had a longer shirt, the view would be gone. Yeah. <laughs> Another epic dress. Another epic dress from Aerie. I mean, this is just so good. I was so tempted to order this in white. Had I not ordered the other dress in white, I would have definitely gotten this one in white. They also have in black, but this sort of tie-dye color in a corally sort of, I guess, peachy color, the white and the black. I mean, all three of these are just epic. The way that it fits, the tiered style, the band around the waist is so good. This color is probably one of my favorites. And I don't think that tie-dye is out of style. I don't know if it ever will be because I'm going to continue to wear my sweatpant tie-dye outfits because I think that they're just so good and so fun. I'm not ready to give them up yet. This dress in this style is just, I mean, I really, I'm having a hard time saying anything bad about it. Let's talk about the fit. I'm in a medium. The fit could not be more perfect. It is a little bit looser in the top, but that's the way that it's supposed to fit. It's supposed to be a little bit blousey on the top because of this sort of very stretchy waistband that sits right above my belly button. There's actually three layers. This first layer and then this second layer, which gives it a tiered look, but then you also have like a lining underneath. This is really short on me as well, you guys, as my butt lands right here, the bottom of my cheeks, but I think that this length is actually a little bit more comfortable, actually a lot more comfortable than the other two that I tried on. It is a lot longer than the other two, so I'm okay with the length. This mini style dress actually fits really well because it's not fitted. If you have a triangle shape like me where I'm smaller on the top and much wider on the bottom, like a actual triangle, like that is my shape, this style and this cut of a dress works really well because we don't have to fight the fabric from coming up in the back 
only ever so slightly because it's going to still do a little bit of lifting which you've seen me try dresses and skirts on and it does that but because this is so tiered it's meant to be you know really a line and has a lot of fabric we don't have to fight against the style and the cut of it it actually works really well the buttons at the top are actual buttons so you can unbutton it if you wanted to an elastic wristband on either side lots of cute detail and lace intricacies around the hem of the dress lots of pleating this is super comfortable around the waist it is not too tight there's no closure so you just literally like throw it on like you would a t-shirt because it is stretchy and because the neckline is so wide, you can actually fit your shoulders through. So I didn't have to unbutton anything. I just threw it on. And I love dresses like that because you don't have to think about getting dressed. You can just put it on and go. And the thing I'm obsessed about most with this dress is the fact that it's just like the skirt that I just tried on before this, but longer, right? So it's longer in the front, shorter on the side, and then longer again in the back. And I just think that this cut of the hem is really flattering. I mean, look at this. It's like meant for me. Oh my God. I saved the bathing suit for last because it's such a good one. But let me be honest with you guys. I actually was sort of disappointed in Aries bathing suit selection. So I got the one that I really loved and that I really just felt like I needed to have, and it was this one. I was a little bit concerned about the fit at first because anytime, you know, I mean, just like anywhere, like I just don't know what proportions are gonna be and sizing for this back part here, which was, I guess, my biggest concern, but it all checks out really well. I'm in a size medium. The color is so yummy it's so yummy this actually used to be one of my favorite colors as a kid and i guess it would still be a favorite now these ties on the side do untie but they are sewn in so do not worry about them untying and losing the little tie i like that they are stitched in for safety purposes the bottoms fit pretty well i do pull it up a little bit on the sides because i think that it's a little bit more flattering let me just go ahead and show you what it looks like probably where they technically like want it to be worn better much better okay you guys see the difference there the bottoms fit really well this actually isn't an issue at all it fits right against my skin which is how it should fit the top is fitting really well they do have removable cups on the inside for those of you who hate them I sometimes love them and sometimes don't need them but oftentimes I think that they give me a little bit of shape and they cover the nipples from being shown. Just love overall everything about this suit. I think the cutout in the front and the cutout in the back is really cute. So this is kind of like a one piece, but like not really, you know what I'm saying? Super stretchy, super comfortable. I think that it's really flattering on me, especially the color. The color, like you guys see what I'm saying about like black being like sort of blah and like blase, but this color on my skin, it just pops. I mean, it, it, color is just is so good on me. I love this color, I love this suit, and that's it. We have officially made it to the end of my airy haul and try on. Thank you guys so much for being here today. I hope it was super helpful. I hope that you guys found some things that you loved, and I hope that you got an understanding of how these things fit on a curvy size eight slash 10 body. If you guys have any questions or comments, I would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so that way you get notification every time I post a new video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.